Gentlemen, due to a story last night, I feel the need to break an order I was given and tell you about the Missouri Goat Man. Now, I'm a chemical guy, and we all go to feet dot lost in the woods to do training. This happened during an FTX out in the woods, next to a ridge and a large stream bed. Every night, there is a roaming guard of two privates, and we have our get little blank adapters and we just roam around making sure no one is having sex. This happens one night when me and a buddy of mine are posted up on a couple of stumps by one of the light systems they drag out there. About 0300, me and my pal are set up under the lamps, soaking in the warm exhaust because it's 25 Fahrenheit outside and fuck if we were going to be moving. We are watching the tents, joking how if anyone was going to do the nasty, it'd be difficult due to the cold, etc. Nudge buddy, tell him to catch a nap. He lolls off and is snoozing. Snow slowly drifting down through the trees. Peaceful. Just kind of staring into the woods when I hear that crunch of snow. Extremely faint, have to perk up my ears to make it out. Think to myself, there's no way somebody is going to freeze his nuts to some girl's ass. Must be a drill sergeant. Nudge my buddy awake, tell him there's a DS in the woods. He perks up, we are both watching the woodline. Sure enough, we see a shadow come in from the woodline, crouching low. Amazing he can be this quiet in the snow. We both grin. Last time this happened, they dragged someone out and tied them to a tree for shits and giggles. The shadow gets well within the camp line, crouching really, really low. Looking back, it was weird. A tent rustles, and the shadow instantly stands up to full height. Fucking it, almost seven feet tall, and it has goddamn horns on this fucking head. Buddy and I suck in our breath, and our eyes are wide. This isn't a fucking DS. The whatever it was opens a tent flap real slow, peeks inside. At this time, my buddy has found the little radio we were given in case we need to contact the drill sergeants. Buddy is freaking out and trying to get them out here, which causes them to freak out and come ghosting out of the fucking shadows. They startle us, and my buddy yells. We all hear a loud grunt. All our heads turn to see this goat thing dragging a goddamn private. It has a female private. It has her leg. Holy shit. It's dragging her out of the camp. Nothing really happens for what feels like hours. Just this surreal fucking stare down. A female DS screams out a war cry and launches herself at a full sprint at it. The rest of the DSs pull out their pistols and charge down to try and get the private. He hop up and run down scrambling to grab the chick and haul her away. The DSs have taken off to chase whatever it was away from the camp. As we are dragging the chick away, the entire camp is up now and setting up a perimeter around the HAA and chow tent. Two areas that have constant light. Tense as fuck, everyone has their bayonets in their hands. DSs come back an hour later, looking worse wear. Everyone loads up in the Humvees and we get the fuck out of there. Apparently the drill sergeants had chased the damn thing over a creek, at which it took off into the underbrush. The female soldier was okay. Whatever it was had smothered her till she passed out. Higher command was weirded out but didn't seem phased and had simply made the DSs carry fully loaded M4s for the next rotations. Oh, big scary goat man? Nah, don't worry about it. Here's bigger guns. Yay, army! And there are tons of these stories, of people just tearing ass out of the woods in full kit, blubbering and get discharged due to mental instability. I myself only have one other story, and this is from a friend of mine who went to MP training there. Friend is on the last FTX in the dead of winter. He is set up with three other people in a tower overlooking a huge expanse of woods. Scheduled OPFOR attack happens, Everyone's having fun shooting blanks. <coughs> Suddenly, a couple of dudes come barreling out of the woods carrying a guy who has a fucking tree branch lodged in his thigh. Everything stops. Everyone leaps into action and drags him onto the FOB. He is screaming and crying about the dear man. DSs instantly scramble for their M4s and get on a loudspeaker, demanding every private into their little hutches. 
DSs break a major rule and hand out live ammo to everyone. Everyone is tense as fuck. That one dude is screaming, the dear man, he's out there, Jesus Christ protect me, the dear man, ha <laughs> ha! And keeps screaming this until the medics arrive. 